Yeah, I can hear you, Todd. I can hear you. Everybody are logged in. Joe, you have to put yourself on the last Okay. Mm -hmm. You hear Billy? And I hear Lynn. <laughs> oh, I know. Him. All right, guys. Sorry, we went from one room to another room real fast, so we got a little bit of a delay getting started. I apologize for that. But you are here now. Hey, Chris. Welcome to the workout today. Let's go ahead and get started. Not in the sun now, so it's a little bit colder. It's a little bit down, ear side, side. It's a different kind of mask. It's like see through, I think. It's the NCAA approved mask that all the athletes have been wearing. I ordered it to see if it works. Left to right. Fancy. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Those are my shoes, you know. Yeah. You do. You can't choose colors. You're gonna have to have orange, but yeah, you know, that's just what I do. Because I mean, if up and down. You can see through it though, but that's not like. Is your breath coming out of it, or? Can you see my breath? No. Okay. Then. I didn't really mean literally breath. <laughs> Air was yes, interesting. Hands up, step back. And then out. My will not blink. Did you register this clock? Oh, it won't blink. <laughs> it won't blink. I keep starting the session. It won't There you go, one. Go. No, I know. But then it's going to start saying monitoring. Oh, did I get through this time? Yeah, I am. I'm here. And I started my watch back in the I started my <laughs> The circles. Yeah, yeah, like I print, I did, I always do my whole week. Okay, I'm gonna do to, that. This but, yeah, but I did it also would kick me off this nope. time if I get to Nope, you wish as many classes as you want. Switch directions. So I go through and I do all one week at a time and then Perfect. Okay. Uh, then we need to ask that. Because we're That's not out yet with the new any new arrangements after the new announcement or anything. Like floral? Uh after the new phase, no, no, floral arrangements. <laughs> Let's scoop and extend out. No, well, because we're not even in the phase yet, so there's no announcement. It's the 22nd. Yeah. Um, there was a video about how they're going to do like bingo night or something that they're going to have different entry lanes or something. So here, here, yeah, different entry lanes. So I guess some people can go through the box nest, some can go through the main entrance, so that. They're coming in, not coming Pinch in. Pinch your shoulders, round them out. Are we going to be on the choreograph? What? <laughs> Hi, Carol.
Matt had come in my place because I knew I wouldn't want to eat lamb. So, but here it was delicious. Yeah, I'm just yeah, like, ladies, you missed out on one heck of a class. Where were you? It was sunny Square. Oh, goodness gracious. And it was sunny. So it got my mom out of town. Go ahead and take one hour up and roll that joint. So where was her husband sitting yesterday? Dead center. Next to dead. Okay. Because I don't know. But I'm wondering. Yep. There were quite a few men there. Oh. Oh, you didn't know which one. Oh. Yes, yeah, so you had Larry and Renee right there. And that was Sue's brother, Ralph, right, over here. So and then that was Blaine right in front. Let's switch arms! Yeah, he would do, he, he did Dino's presentations often, and, but they're not doing those anymore. <clears throat> but so I did try a new recipe, a different, uh, that was going to be my recipe, but I thought, okay, I'll, I'll really do a recipe, and so I, I just made cookies I've never made before. <laughs> you could have said that and just substituted your meat at home. Big arm circles. You could have done ground beef. Oh. Ground turkey, ground chicken, impossible meat. Uh, well, and I made, uh, I've never used bar eggs to pot before, so I made some boiled eggs in my, in, in <laughs> hard boiled eggs. <laughs> so, cooking is not my strong suit. I never invented any. Well, I suppose I pretended when Blaine and I were first dating. <laughs> Didn't last very long. Arms up, thumbs down, tiny circles. But you know what I went home and we made for dinner? What? Chicken and waffles. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have lamb chops to go with these lamb soup. So which directions? It wasn't lamb soup. I mean, lamb, I've got time. Chef is fine. <clears throat> oh, I'm good. <laughs> Good, relax those arms, rotate shoulders over hands. It was never nice to sleep. I am doing Guinness soup for uh, tomorrow night's dinner, though. Maybe that's what we're doing at St. Patrick's. And if you've been there, you've learned that corned beef and cabbage is not. Uh, right. <laughs> Corned beef is not a St. Patrick's Day meal. In Ireland. Uh, it's an American thing. Like that? They don't eat corned beef. Uh, huh. It was when the Irish immigrants came over to the U.S. And they bought their meat from the Jewish delis in New York. And they were able to get corned beef. And they served that with their staple potatoes and cabbages food they were used to. And hence you got corned beef and cabbage. But if you go touring around Ireland, it's a very popular restaurant. Know, it's not it's there. It's just, <laughs> you'll find shepherd's pie everywhere. You'll find Irish stew, Guinness stew, and lamb shanks, things like that. But no, almost everything on your Irish pub menus here are not Irish. <laughs> yeah. They don't do Irish nachos in Ireland. <laughs> you see those? Irish. Good, let's push those hips back, reach those hands down. Walk those hands out. Drop those hips towards the floor. We did get to go sit in the stands and watch our youngest play football last night. Oh, that's awesome. That's Good. Hips up. Step to the outside. Push that knee away.
Good, pick that hip up, bring that leg across the middle, sit back and see your hip. Lord is stopping us again. <laughs> She's at work. She may be sure you're working. She'll come home and tell me that she saw some hot guy on TV. She wants to do his workout later. <laughs> so if I ever find is that guy. Is he Korean? If I ever find that guy, he is into it. Good. Bring that leg up. Let's switch sides. I was speaking to a school teacher this weekend, and I couldn't get a logical explanation to why the school district is slating our kids' hours. Good. Pick that up, bring that leg across. It's not universal. Like I, I know that we're in our own district, but like the Piaf school district, they're on a completely different. Like the kids are going different hours, different times. And doing virtual and at least some class. Virtual and. and they're doing like four half days instead of two fulls, and but then they're still doing online. Good, let's bring that leg back. Walk those feet forward, push back to those heels. If you want to get into that chest and shoulders, bring those arms up and over. Hips back forward and stand it up. All right, guys, time to get that heart rate up because none of us are working right now. It looks like we were stretching as we work. So whatever you'd like to do, wherever you're at, jog in place, run around outside. Billy, I know you're going to do some assaults. I'm going to do jumping jacks. So jump along. Let's get that heart rate up. And we're going to keep doing cardio until Carol shows up on the main screen. Safety first. Yes. Carol G's on top of that. I thought she was going to go over the next time. <laughs> no, but I'm collecting little screws and things that I've been picking up that kids can be violent these days. Almost there, guys. My group has successfully launched themselves into the old range. The result was shooting for. I'm in red, which is rarely I'm really getting into red.
We are going to get a little bit dynamic in the legs today if you're capable after this first round. Just be ready for that. Good. We're going to go right from squats into alternating lunges. You can lunge forward or lunge backwards as long as you're giving yourself that nice clean lunge. First, uh, first box of phones showed up, waiting on one more. <laughs> they sent the phones, all of our phones, in different carriers. <laughs> so a chunk of the phones came FedEx, and another chunk of the phones are coming UPS. Are they different phones, or? Yes. Okay. Well, there's five phones are the same, and two phones are okay. the same. Good. From our lunges, we're going to go back. Down into our plank position from our hands. And when you plank, shoulder touch. So remember to keep those feet spaced out a little bit. And we're trying not to let our hips wiggle side to side. We want to hold our ground on every shoulder touch. From there, swing on to your back. And now we're starting with this one today, so who knows where this craziness is going. Into your runner crunch. Up, opposite knee to shoulder. Swing that all the way back down. Switch sides. Last two. Good. We're going to swing back to our plank position. And this time, instead of our hands, we're going to be moving our legs. We're going to bring our knee up to the outside and the knee tuck. Start in that plank position and then drive that knee to the outside. Back and forth. Back on our feet, that's our five warm-up exercises. We're going to go through that two more times. Sandy warmed up. Okay, starting with those squats. Right from here, alternating lunges. Mm -hmm. 
Well, I'm going to tell you, so far, this mask is incredible. Good. Down on the ground, plank shoulder touch. And on to our back, four hour crunch. Transition into lunges. Down on the ground, plank shoulder touch. Good. Back in the plane. Knee tucks to the outside. Down, guy. Go grab quickly there. 
This is my being careful for that, huh? Rest in calm, guys, sir. It's not going to be a class of second half of that workout. How's that happening? Yeah, you're right. Very right. All right, guys. So we're going to move into the next round. We're not going to get too intense with the squat this round. We're going to get a little more dynamic with the lunges and the rest of the exercises. So we're going to start here with the squat. Narrow the wide. So you're going to sit down to that squat. You're just going to step out wide. Squat. Bring that foot together. Squat. And then back to squat. So here we go. Wide. Narrow. Narrow. Good. One more each way. Good. For this next one with our lunge, if you're ready for it, you're going to add a little dynamic coming out of it into a knee drive hop. So you're going to step back into that lunge. Hop. Step back. Hop. So I'm lifting that knee up in front and hopping. Now. Yeah, I was all ready. It didn't seem to work very well. That ain't fucking hell. And then you switch it over. If you don't feel like hopping, you can just knee drive. Knee drive. Tippy toe. Good. We're down on the ground in the plank position. Reaching into the basket of Sandy's favorites. And we're going to do our plank push ups or elbow push ups. Starting in plank, dropping down to the elbows, popping up, and switching sides. So back on the opposite side. Instead of running, we're going to bike to do bicycle crunch. Flip them back over. We're going to go plank on forearms. And Sandy gets to double up today. We're going to do hip rolls. 
<laughs> so on those forearms, tilt that hip to the side and down. Tilt it to the other side and down. That's round two progression. Okay, guys. No to wide. Now squat. Wide squat. Good. Lunge to hop. Step back. Knee up. Little hop. Three. Switch legs at ten. Push-ups, plank push-ups. Flip it over, hip rolls. I promise the third round is way easy.
on your back. Bicycles. Good. Hip rolls. Thank you. 
bounce your back. We're going to rotate. We're going to windshield breaker. Keep your up range low again. Protect that back if you need to bend your leg. Back and forth. Bye, Billy. <laughs> now, we've been working on our sides. We're actually going to go on our side now. On our forearm, either hit legs stacked or put the top leg in front. Or if you really need to work up the strength here, bend your legs and be just on the edge of your knees. All are acceptable. We're going to bring our hips up off the ground into that side plank. We want to dip here for 10. You don't have to hit the ground. You're just activating. And then you'll flip and do the other side. Flip over, spin around. I just spin so I'm facing you for demo. Woo! And that is round three. First time through. So we're back on our feet. Guys, we're still in yellow. We're not working that hard. We got more. We got more. Pop squats. Here we go. Windshield wipers. Side plank and hip drop. I'm not working hard. Drop me down. All right. Okay. Last set. Pop squat. Last time through, guys. You know the rule. If you haven't already, it's time to empty that gas tank. Here we go. This set should be a struggle. It should be a struggle. It's not a failure if it's a struggle. It means you push yourself right all the way to the end here. You got the most out of your body for a full workout. Four, three, two, and one. Split jumps.
Last two. Yeah. Side plank. These guys feel that way. I can see what I'm looking at. I can see it right up there. Guys, when we push fast, sometimes we finish early. There's nothing wrong with that. I think these four will agree with me. We didn't meet them more minutes. We pushed ourselves all the way to the end there. We got the most out of our workout today. If you feel like you got more in the tank, well, good job. Kudos. Maybe you did push really hard and you're that fit. Or maybe. Probably could have pushed a little harder on some of those exercises. Even if it meant regressing back an exercise to get more reps and technique, and less pushing yourself a harder exercise than not getting much out of it. Remember that the most important part is getting our heart rate and keeping it up while we get these muscle groups. So happy Tuesday. Thanks so much for joining us today, Total Body Weight Fitness. Until the next class, I bid you adieu. Bye bye. Oh.